Hello violins. Today we're going to be working on page 31 in Essential Elements book 2. And on this page we'll be working on eighth note triplets. Now a triplet is when you take a note value where you would normally have two of a certain note value in a beat or in a measure and you replace it with three of the same note value within the same amount of time. So for example, if you're in 4-4, four, four, normally you're gonna be subdividing each beat into two eighth notes, so one and two and three and four and. And if you want to instead have some of them subdivided into three eighth notes, you would make them triplets. So a uh, triplet is basically three eighth notes that occupies the same amount of time that you would normally give two eighth notes, so one beat in four four. So you would count that as one triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four triplet, or one and a two and a three and a four and a would be another way to do it. Now, when you have triplets, you have the notes beamed in groups of three, and um, to, to make it clear that it is a triplet and not um, just three regular eighth notes, um, they'll generally put a number three over the beam and that tells you that those three notes, those three eighth notes are taking the place of two eighth notes in the time signature. Now, you could really make a triplet out of any note value. You could have 16th note triplets, three 16th notes in the place of two 16th notes. You could even have quarter note triplets. We sometimes call those delayed triplets and that would be three quarter notes occupying the same number of beats as you would normally give two quarter notes. On this page, we only have eighth note triplets and uh, we're in four four on this whole page. So the eighth note triplets would be basically just one beat. Um, let's go ahead and get started with number 136 rhythm wrap. We're gonna play this on our open D string. same rhythm with the descending D major scale for number 137 D major scale with triplets. Good, now let's do 138 on the move. slurring triplets is really just the same um, same uh, melody as number 138 on the move um, except that the triplets are slurred so when you are slurring triplets you just uh, you combine them together in the same bow stroke and keep the bow moving so just like that this might be easier because you can just kind of keep the bow moving at the same speed throughout this and uh, when you have the triplets it's basically just three notes in one beat and in one bow to number 140 triplet etude and this one and the next one little river are again the same notes and melody just one of them has no slurs and one of them does have the slurs so we'll start with the triplet etude which has no slurs play the same thing with slurs for number 141, Little River. Excellent. And then we'll go ahead and finish up this page with number 142, Field Song. Nice 
job. Um, the triplets is something that's really important to get the hang of because those do come up quite a lot in our music. So now that you've learned how to play them, I'm sure that you will soon see them in your ensemble music. Um, so I hope you enjoy practicing these songs with triplets. Good luck and happy practicing.